I use square inch tiles to show an array that represents 3 times 5. First, I'm going to trace the length of the array in blue. The length of the first side is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 inches long. First, I'm going to trace the length of the array in blue. The length of the first side is 1 inch, 2 inches, 3 inches, 4 inches, 5 inches long. When I look at the opposite side, the length is the same because the opposite sides of rectangles have an equal length. Now, I'm going to trace the width of the array. The width is 1, 2, 3 inches. The opposite side has the same width because it is a rectangle. When I look at my array, I can see that I measured the length, I measured the other length, I measured the width, and the other width. This was 5. This was also 5 because the opposite lengths of a rectangle are the same length. This was 3 inches and this was 3 inches. To find the perimeter of the rectangle, I'm going to join the lengths and widths. 5 plus 5 plus 3 plus 3 equals 16. I can also say I traced two lengths and I traced two widths and I joined them to add the perimeter. Two times five inches, two times three inches, two times five is ten, two times three is six, ten plus six is sixteen.